I was around her. And I'm like, <laughs> what? <laughs> you was around who? This is my background music, cause I don't wanna get copyrighted. So I made my own shit to this beat, kinda laying low key, but join the team. Subscribe, subscribe. I really should not be filming this video right here because Layden's in the room sleep and I don't want to wake him up and I feel like I might be a little loud when I start talking about this. <laughs> Disclaimer, I want to say, was I really the side chick though? No, I don't believe so because I don't play that role. I'm not about that position, not a homewrecker. I'm gonna be eating my hot fries while I talk about this because this story, <laughs> Disclaimer, one, I wasn't aware <laughs> of the situation. <laughs> Two, I do not condone anybody being a side chick knowing that you're talking to a dude that has a girlfriend or a wife or whatever. Don't be a homeworker. Boom. I'm not gonna say when this was, when this took place. Nobody is ever gonna find out who this man is, but listen. Boom. Let me set the, the scenery. I met this dude, got Instagrams, whatever. This man is fine. I am not gonna lie to y'all. This man is fine. This nigga like six, seven tattoos. Built, bro, like he is built. He just fine. <laughs> I was like, oh, he fine. Then, you know, got Instagrams, whatever like that. Slid into the DMs and that's how we start talking. This man's profession is something that I was interested in. Not so much like for him, but for me, like I wanted to do it type of thing. We start talking about like, um, the profession that he's in and all that other great stuff and you know like we just started talking every day and we would go back and forth on Instagram listen okay just <laughs> listen to the story take notes at first I didn't see any red flags of like oh maybe he got a girlfriend but like when you see like a fine dude and you be like what's wrong with you like <laughs> why you don't have a girlfriend why are you single like what is wrong with you that's how I kind of was I was kind of skeptical because I was like you know no he didn't have any evidence on his Instagram that he had a girlfriend it was just like him and his kid on his Instagram so I was like okay you know type of thing like he's not with the kid's mom but like me personally when I talk to somebody with kids hmm yeah because I have a kid myself before I had later I always be like nah I don't want to talk to no man with no kids two mm, I was kind of pushing it if you're cool with your baby moms I'm gonna be skeptical of the relationship type of thing. Just speaking from my experience. Okay, so like I was saying, looking at the dude's Instagram, you wouldn't know he had a girlfriend. This man texts me all day, so you wouldn't think he had a girlfriend. What was a red flag to me? The first one that I was like, mm, that's kind of, what you doing? Like, are you being sneaky? I know what to look for. Speaking as the red flags, if a dude is cheating on their girlfriend, like how to be sneaky. I've been cheating on before. I know what to look for. I see what I've seen and like how a dude goes about being sneaky. So I know the signs. I know what to look for, okay? So this is how I knew and I was like, this man got a girlfriend because if you got a girlfriend, why are you talking to me? Why are you in my DMs, sir? Why are you texting me? Why are you calling me? Why are you sending me? I'm just, okay, anyways. Okay, back to when we were just talking in the DMs on Instagram. I asked him like, oh, you got a Snapchat? Cause like, first of all, I don't have my notifications on, um, on Instagram. So when people DM me, I don't get it. Or like, the only way I would know you DM me if it's I checked. So like, if we're having a conversation, I don't want to be like, replying to you eight hours later because I forgot that you DM me type of thing. So I was like, you got Snapchat? Because I'm always on Snapchat. Like Snapchatting me, I use that instead of giving people my number. I was like, you got Snapchat? And he was like, yeah, but I don't really be on there. He was like, but I'll Snapchat you if like that's the easiest way for you to communicate type of thing. What I noticed was this man's snap score. Like I don't remember the specific number, but it was no more than like a hundred. So I was like, like, I know you say you don't be on Snapchat, but for you to not have a snap score over like 300, you know, like, I was like, <laughs> did you just make this Snapchat just to talk to me? Why are you being sneaky type of thing? He gave me his number and was like, just text me because I don't be on here. So I'm like, all right, boom. So then he was like on Snapchat, like he wouldn't reply, but he will reply, he will reply faster on Instagram. So we were like Snapchatting, Instagramming, and texting like all at once, right? Having like three different conversations. Then one day I was on Snapchat and I've seen that he watched my story, but it wasn't 
like his username wasn't the name that he first gave me so I clicked and I was like who's it who snapchat is this in like my friends or whatever so I clicked I was like who snapchat is this and then I realized that it was his because I slid over he had saved a chat and then I was like, okay, so this is this man. But we're we not even gonna call him nothing because this is just this man. And then I'm like, why did he change his Snapchat username? Weird. We were talking for like three, four months. He would like text me every morning like, oh, good morning, da 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 You know? So we were like building like a friendship type of thing. It was just weird to me because I was like, why are you, like, why did you make a Snapchat just to talk to me? And then when he like, this man was sending the pictures and videos and stuff, I wasn't because I don't do that. But he grown, if he want to do that, he can do that. He was doing that. He was sending them, not even on Snapchat, on Instagram, but I, he's the one who's like introduce me into like this Instagram picture bomb things where you can send like basically a snapchat and somebody DMs like you can only see however long they set their picture for um through Instagram I didn't even know you could do that but this man started doing that and I was like why are you sending me like first of all you have my number you have my snapchat which that like that's what snapchat's for so like when you're chatting on Snapchat, sending pictures, so people won't save them or you'll know they saved it if because it tells you it's screenshots. So when he starts sending the little picture bomb things on Instagram, I'm like, sir, what are you doing? You're being sneaky. And I was like, you got a girlfriend? And he was like, nah, I ain't got no girlfriend, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay. Maybe he just don't want me a screenshot, which I wouldn't anyways, but I'm like, all right, maybe he just don't want me a screenshot of his stuff. <laughs> but how it was set up, it was like, this man is grown, 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 okay? Older than me, way older than me. And you're acting my age, like, I don't like that. <laughs> so then one day we were DMing each other on Instagram because he had slid up on my story. It was just going back and forth on Instagram. And then like, he went ghost for like a week. I'm like, all right, like, man, like, I'm, you know, I'm not gonna stress over no nigga. So I'm like, all right, I'm not gonna stress over you. Like, if that's what you do, that's what you do. Cause at this point in my mind, I was like, this man got a girlfriend. Like, I'm not even gonna entertain you anymore. Like, you have a girlfriend, you're being weird. You're being sneaky. I know, I know when you being sneaky, I've had it done on me. Let me see, let me see. Because I really believe that I still have the DMs. Boom, got them. But okay, so. Look, look, look. Wow, I haven't looked through these in a minute. Okay, I don't wanna show y'all because you're obviously gonna see who it is and who it's from. So he was just like picture bombing me, right? And one day he picture bombs me, but instead of him, him doing his little picture bombs, the norms, it was a text. Like it was just him in his car, but he like snapped it and he texted on there and he was like, no, what he say, I'm trying to remember the exact words he said. I'm not gonna know the exact words because this was a minute ago, but the text along the lines of something, 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 I was around her. And I'm like, what? He <laughs> was around who? Basically like, my bad for not hitting you up, I was around her. So I'm like, bitch, what? <laughs> so I was like, like what? <laughs> Question mark, <laughs> confused. <laughs> she got me <laughs> I was like, what the, what you mean? You was around her. I was confused. So then I asked him, I was like, so you do got a girlfriend. That's why you did it, da -da -da, like I was putting two, six, and eight together in my head. I was like, that's really why this man over here being real sneaky because he got a girlfriend. Go with your gut feeling, because it's always right. A woman's intuition never lies. I knew this man had a girlfriend. At first, I didn't want to believe it because it was fun. But I ain't about that homework in life, so I was like, Hey, there's no point of me talking to you. I was a little confused. I was kind of like curious. I wanted to know more details about this whole relationship because like if you're talking to me all day, every day, texting me, snapchatting me, DMing me, picture bombing me, where's your girlfriend at? Nigga, I asked you this a long time ago. You could have said you had a girlfriend a long time ago and I would not be talking to you. 
men irk my soul. They get on my nerves. So this was his explanation for the whole girlfriend. One, he liked me. Two, he don't be around a girlfriend like that. Then, as I was at questioning him more, come to find out, I guess the girlfriend live in a different state, which, first of all, now I'm remembering, the girlfriend lived in a different state, but I would see him going to a different state. Like, he'll post when he in that state on his um, Instagram stories. Like, you know how you can tag the um, location you at? So he would tag that here and there. He would go like every two weeks, every other week, to the girl state and I'm like thinking like oh maybe that's where his kid lived because when he would go to the state like he would post a lot with the kid and I'm like oh he just going out there for the kid no because now that I think about it he was taking the kid just so it was a happy little family okay listen wow he was taking the kid out there like they was all around each other so that means they like Oh, they were serious because look, let me finish the story because I wouldn't have my kid around nobody that I'm not serious with because I don't want to introduce my son to like her uncle, brother's stepfather. Like, no, my he, they not finna come around later. Turns out the man, every time he was in a different state, he was going to see his girlfriend. And then now all of a sudden, it's okay for him to talk to me because they're in an open relationship. So I don't need to cut him off because they're in an open relationship. So like it's good for us to talk. He was trying to lay that on thick. Like let me tell you, he was trying to lay it on thick. That they were in an open relationship and she's okay with him talking to me. And I'm like, what? Like, I, I want no part. Sir, deleted that man number, took him off my Snapchat because first of all, he changed his whole, you know, the whole Snapchat was not even his no more, I don't think. Maybe he changed the username so his girlfriend wouldn't see because he can lie and say like, oh, that's the homie Snapchat, he was logged in. Look, yep, that's what it is. Because if I was a dude with a girl and she logged onto my Snapchat, I would say like, oh, that's the homie Snapchat, you know? That's smart thinking. So he was smart for that one because hopefully that's the lie he came up with because that's the most logical lie don't be lying I don't like liars but that was that so boom that happened I deleted his number unfollow him off Instagram deleted the snapchat because you can't ch you can't chat me on snapchat unless you're my friend so I don't care if you watching me still but you can't contact me so yeah that was that never talk to that man again okay but then since you know how Instagram set up like the explore page like the stories you like or like the people you follow Friends pop up on your explore page or posts of like Instagram accounts you liked in the past will pop up on your explore page type of thing I would say like a month after all this happened okay i'm scrolling on instagram this man's picture pop up i know it's him like i know what you look like and without even seeing his head i knew it was his picture so i clicked on it so then i go on and click on his instagram see what pictures he been posting how he been what he been up to type of shit because you know like i was bored in this man's bio <laughs> Listen here, grab your mother chips because what I seen in the bio, I was like, oh my goodness, men aren't shh, shh. not all of them, him, him specifically ain't shh. everything that was in his bio before it was still the same. Mixed up and all that said, engaged. <laughs> Engaged? <laughs> what? Then I'm trying to wrap my head around the fact that this man engaged, but like he still don't have no pictures of the girl, no pictures of when he proposed, the ring, this like ain't nothing on his Instagram. Slide off Instagram, okay? <laughs> Listen how fast this went. Swipe off Instagram. Text my best friend because she knew who the who the man was. Text my best friend like, why is so and so got engaged in the bio? So we sitting there put in two and two together from this day and that day and just like talking back and forth like this is why blah 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 you know how girls do bro what so I try to go back onto his Instagram to screenshot it and send it to my best friend but as I'm doing that I'm not on the explore page anymore so I type in his name on the search bar I try to click on his Instagram why is his page private I can still see engage in the bio so I just screenshot that and send it to her but like he's now his page is private right I'm sitting here 
shook. I am shook. You talking to me, but I had a whole serious ass relationship because it's serious enough for you to want to marry her. Like to be able to get down on one knee, pick out a ring and tell her you want to spend the rest of your life with her. All within like two weeks after I found out this man had a girlfriend. <laughs> my, my mind was blown. At this point, I done seen it all. I've witnessed everything I need to witness to let me know you cannot put anything past anybody. Don't put nothing past nobody, okay? I'm always on 10 now. I'm like, I've been through a lot in my past. I know people's body language and how they act and talk. When you being sneaky, I can, I can read that now. I know, I've experienced it. I know when you're being sneaky, sir. And at first I was like, something ain't right. Like you being real sneaky. I know why he was being sneaky because he had a whole ass girlfriend serious enough to meet his kids. Then serious enough for him to engage to the girl to propose, that's the word, to propose. And now they engage. And I'm just like, wow. <laughs> wow. But yeah, that's the story. By the time I found out, this man tried to make me his side chick. And no, no, <laughs> not heard about it. And the funniest part about all this, the whole reason why I even remembered this story and even thought about this man is because I seen him on my explore page again because I guess he unprivated his Instagram. He did because I went to go look at it. So he unprivated his Instagram, which allowed one of his pictures to pop up on my explore page. And I seen it and I was like, is this so and so? And I was like, okay, let me go look at his wife. Hopefully it's his wife by now because it's been some time. And I go on his page. Why I'm alone? He for sure don't have engaged in his bio no more. <laughs> what um future say? He belonged to the streets. His Instagram looked like he living his best life. So hey, kudos to him. Kudos to her. I still want nothing to do with it. Anywho, that's the story on how I found out this whole man I was talking to was literally engaged. Not the whole time, but damn near shit. <laughs> I have a lot of stories in my life. Oh, I'm gonna tell that one next because that this whole story just reminded me. I totally forgot about that man. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys more stories about situations like this because that's not the first time somebody tried to make me their side chick. Now that I think about it, it's this other little man. That story is crazy. Er, like when. <laughs> I'm gonna just tell y'all next time. Let's try to get this video to like 5,000 likes and I'll tell that story on how this dude, literally, literally I was the side chick and I had no idea. At least this situation, it was like, he like broke it down to me like, oh, they're in an open relationship. But the other dude was literally in a whole relationship for years, bro, years. Why does this happen to me? And it's not even like, I try to like be thirsty for these niggas and go out and slide I didn't they DMs. No, they be in mine. So I'll be bored and I kind of entertain it. Maybe I need to stop entertaining it. This is what I'm gonna do from here on out because my sister Naya, she's a full on private investigator. FBI needs to hire her. Everybody get on her because she can literally find out your whole life <laughs> in like five seconds. I don't have the energy for that. I'm not gonna be the one to stalk her Instagram, her friend's Instagram, this, this, and that to try to put two and two together. I don't have the energy for that. Like, if I have to do all that, I'm not even gonna be with you. But Naya, Naya's your girl. If you need help, if you think your man's cheating on you, hit up Naya because she will let you know in five minutes she got you. Instead of entertaining it because I'm bored, I'm gonna be like, you know, this man seemed like he got potential. Find out what you need to find out, then bring it back to me. And then I might talk to him. So yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Like I said, get this video to 5,000 likes if you want to see me talk about the other dude because that was freaking crazy. It was crazy to the point like I hung out with that dude a lot and did not know he had a girlfriend. Anyways, make sure you follow me on all my other social media accounts. They are down below. Instagram, Dejale, TikTok, Dejale, Snapchat, Deja underscore Lamagie. In the description box, click that, open it up if you want to know how to spell anything. But yeah, on that note, Oh my god.
almost just died. <laughs> Bye.